minutes are bust. We're gonna be. I'm gonna push for trying to beat it, beat it, but like I said, the mini boss in this is ridiculous. We're live. Hello, everyone. Welcome to another episode of Rare Bird Entertainment Gaming. I'm Johnny Bliss, and I am here with Phoenix. Yo. And we're playing Legend of Zelda: Ocarina of Time. Oh. Boy! So the room you want to go in this time is the first one you went into. So it should be not this one, but that one, the one with the two torches. It's where you saw Rudo again. Oh. But you're going to go up to the second level. You've been to the third level of this room and the first level of this room, but not the second level. So you want to remove your boots right, like, by the entrance. I mean, it doesn't matter. You can shit. Remove your boots at wherever. Okay, so you need to move. Yeah, there we go. Oh, man, a giant crack in the wall. What would you ever do? It's gonna blow. Bet you'll never guess where you need to go now. Oh. Back to the main room. up to the middle level and there is a locked door that you're gonna go through it should be on the west side give or take so not there Come on, figure your shit out. Okay, go near that water and wait, wait, wait. You'll see why. That's why. Now stand on that water and then hit the crystal with your bow. Oh, excuse me. Okay. Yep. Stand in front of that and pull out your ocarina. That left block that raised, go to that. And if this is the room I think it is, you're about to be in a very, very difficult room. It's a good thing you sometimes. You cannot get that gold sculpture like yet. So don't even bother yourself. It's on the right wall. You can't get it yet. So, here's what you have to do. You can go ahead and jump down on that platform. You have to... There's another platform below you. You want to get on that one. 
Now this one raises up and down. But the thing is, you need to hook shot to those platforms that are steadily sinking down and keep hook shotting up until you can get up into that alcove. It's going to be a pain. Period. So. Just take your time. It, it's a very difficult thing. Come on, baby! Get me to where I need to go. You can't skip one, by the way. Just so you know. You have to do it one by one. Not saying that you tried that, but I tried to let you know. Oh yeah, it's good to know. It's a pain. It really is. I don't know what made them think this was a good idea to put in. Yeah, it's a great idea. This will be revolutionary to the game of time. Everyone will look back on this as a fondful memory. I will look on this as a continual... Uh, I will look on this as a reflection of what purgatory is like. Perhaps. Oh, as you can tell, I'm getting steadily annoyed by this. Very frustrating. There we go. Alright. Oh, it wasn't terrible. Wait. In this room, you'll have to hit the crystal switch in the center of the room with your hook shot to raise and lower the water level repeatedly. By raising it, you'll make the statues float up, revealing targets. Should you fall in water while the water is low, you'll have to equip the iron boots and hit the crystal switch with your hookshot to get back to the platforms. First of all, I suggest raising the water, then lowering the tech types over to the starting platform where you can kill them off. Now to the actual puzzle. Okay, I can walk you through this puzzle. Raise the water. Shoot them with your arrows. Yes. We'll be right back. What's up? Oh boy. Figuring this out. No. Okay. Raise it up. Okay. To your left. Hook shot to that one. You can hit that crystal with your hook shot too, so you're not wasting arrows. Okay. Now, hold up. 
hit the crystal again to lower the water. Yeah, just go ahead and... Just easier. Okay, now the platform that's closest to you, you can hookshot over to it through a hookshot on in the wall. to take a step or two closer. Okay, you got put on your iron boots. And hit the target. I mean, hit the uh, crystal with your hook shot. Take off your boots. I would have said something if I knew it was going to do that. I'm not looking forward to this next part. Now, when I put my joystick up, did that mean down? No. That, that's okay. <laughs> Do you really want me to play the ocarina, don't you? <sighs> Fucking joysticks weren't meant to do these kind of things. No, they weren't. That's why it was buttons on the original controller. Okay, now climb over that head carefully because you're going to have to jump down on the other side without jumping into the water. There you go. Now raise it again. And then you can hook shot to the last island. Does that look like a... Uh, oh, man. That's not what I'm... Dude, I am... I believe you. Piece of... Dookie! What does that look like to you, Link? Bro, you stupid? Now you gotta lower it one more time. You gotta stand on the head and raise it one last time, and then you're done with this room. Unless you die in the next room. 
which is possible. Oh, you're not gonna like the next one. You're not gonna like it one bit. Kill these guys. Now, before you cross the spikes, either kill that thing by doing charge spin slashes or throwing bombs at it. Because you don't want that thing to eat you because he steals your shield and your tunic and if you don't kill him fast enough after he steals your shield and tunic, you have to buy them again. One more should do it. Okay, you'll have to hook shot across. There is a target somewhere. Roof, yeah. And while this is cheap, make a safe state right here. Create restore point. Because I don't want you going through the waterfall room in that puzzle room again. <laughs> Me neither. Collect those pots if you want. Oh, I need some energy. <laughs> oh, well, I, I, I totally get that. Well, I think you might be able to hookshot it. No. Crap. Later games, you can do that. There we go, that's good. Alright, well, let's see what's behind door number this. And I am no longer helping you, because this is probably where we will be stopping after you beat this. After I beat this? No, oh, maybe I was wrong. <sighs> Wait, go back? Shut the fuck up! Thank <laughs> you. 
Load your safe state. There's no way to beat him. Yes, there is. Told you you wouldn't like this room. Told you you wouldn't like this dungeon. Could you imagine if I wasn't guiding you through this? Yeah, this would have been a pain in my ass. You definitely wouldn't have gotten to the mini boss this week. <laughs> now, the trick is you do have to go all the way across the room and then all the uh, halfway back. That That is the trick to make him appear. Ooh, getting clever, are we? Thinking about it. Okay, we should be there now. Yep. He disappears like that, that means he took damage. Just so you know. So you were actually doing damage to him throughout the fight last time. Point. Piece of advice, they recommend not doing Z targeting because he counters two of your Z targeting attacks. Oh, okay. Did the controller die? 
and try to get both those magic pots because Den's Fire was actually another recommendation for fighting. Yep, this controller's dead. Mm -hmm. My passive controller has not been charged. I can go get batteries. That's about all I can do. Where we get batteries real quick before we start. All right, well, ladies and gentlemen. <coughs> Sorry, forgive me. So, how's the new year going so far for you guys? Yeah, yeah, Link, we know. Not for long, sweetheart, don't worry. Basically, tell you beat this and reap your rewards for beating it. Then I'm, then we're calling it. All right. So. There you go. Fuck. All right. Blah blah blah. A surprise. surprise. You think I should do a restore point here? I mean, you can if you want. Surprise. No, put it up. She has my tablet. <laughs> <laughs> she has a couple games on it. She Wait wants to play. All right, you sneaky little bastard. Let's play. Yeah, just sit there and watch me move. Much harder to fight him without being targeting. He doesn't hit you as much because he only matches your attacks instead of. Hey, Mog, watch this move. Counter attacking. Now he gets much more aggressive as time passes the That's the room you want to go in, I believe. <coughs> cool. There's your prize. Prize! What is it? What is it? What is it? Come on, gimme, give gimme, give gimme, give gimme, gimme! Cool. <laughs> Don't think it was worth the, what you had to go through for it? Make a restore point, that's where we're calling it a week. Uh, everyone, hope you enjoyed that. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs>